Okay, here we go. Rocket's Red Glare. Oh, see, can you see by the dawn's early light? La, da, 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 da. Yeah, we're aboard the Pridwin, and uh, this is a special op. We have to plant three bombs and get the F out of Dodge. Two guys off to your right as soon as you get aboard. I usually like to use Tinker Tom's special because it's nice and silent. Take off this uh, BOS individual off to the left here. And dead ahead, um, Proctor Ingram is going to pop in. I've got Psycho Buff happening. And I want to take some Orange Mentats as well. And I also want to swap, um, or rather hotkey the Hallucigen Gas Grenade. <laughs> Insert Diabolical Laughter. And my Old Faithful Midtown, just in case I get some really heavy... Uh, close quarter combat, and I run out of uh, action points. Now, dead ahead, Proctor Ingram is going to pop in. I don't know if this always happens when you do this mission, or is just happening to me. But uh, I noticed in practice rounds, she always popped in right there. So I'm just going to ambush her as soon as she pops in. Ghost rifle, that headshot, a couple of shots should do her in. Really sorry to do this, but uh, hey, it's my job. And wipe the floor with her. Okay, up into the Pridwin command deck. As soon as you pop in, slide to your left up this slope here, okay? Be kind of like out of sight here. Keep your sneak on. Whack anybody that comes up the stairs. The guy in the power armor is going to get suspicious. Down he goes. Now whenever possible, just start spamming the grenades down the stairs there. And that'll either send them chasing up the stairs, or Grenade! it'll kill them. <laughs> Tell me. Here's the... Oh, that was a quite hit popping goodness, but what the hell. <laughs> Blowing shit up here, boss. Yeah. So you can bring it down to a dull roar. We're going to head over to the Pridwin main deck. I'm doubling in the commentary on this one because uh, I'm getting behind on video production. I absolutely had to record this this afternoon, and this afternoon the most hellacious renovations Attention. noise this is going on next door. My mic was picking it up. Okay, now as soon as you pop that guy, that was weird the way he landed, eh? As soon as you pop that guy, jam down some jet, put yourself in slow motion. You're running up the stairs here, doing about face, running up these stairs, hanging right, and you're at the level where all the bombs need to be planted. They're marked fairly clearly here. There's one right there. Anyone found in possession of undocumented technologies will be subject here. to inquiry and punishment. Two bombs planted. And Jet just ran out. Three bombs planted, and then I usually like to run all the way to the end of this kind of like corridor to the north end. Now I know you can win a speech challenge with this little kid here, but it's kind of glitched out. The whole thing is kind of glitched out. The sound is glitched out. I don't know why that is. So I, I just shot at him to chase him away, but I know you can win like several speech challenges with that guy. And uh, con him into thinking that, you know, you're a Brotherhood of Steel guy. Now, that you're at this end of the corridor, you have a beautiful choke point. You see, everybody can only come at you with one, from one direction. So this is great. I just plow into everybody with the, the ghost rifle. Yeah, I know, I'm plowing into the ghost rifle. Something happened here. I don't know what the hell happened. My my controls are malfunctioning. I was pressing the fire button and nothing happened. Beautiful. 
and chat with this guy. Now, once they stop coming up the stairs, what I usually like to do is just wait and see if I can get hidden again. If you can get hidden, you're golden. You don't really have to fight your way out. You can just sneak your way out. Why don't you make this easy for both of us? Okay, so just wait it out. Patience is a virtue. And I just swapped over to my hallucinogen grenade. Hallucinogen gas grenades, that's very important. Don't forget also that we have a stealth boy that... I believe Deacon? Was it Deacon who gave us that? Or Tinker Tom? I think it was Deacon. Yeah. And we can really use that. Bingo. Okay, let's sneak our way out. Not gonna loot anything. Pushing hard towards the end of the railroad faction main quest line, so I have plenty of resources to finish off the game here. So enough of the looting already. Enough of the hoarding, enough of the stockpiling, enough of the money making. Let's just game. Okay, so I just want to retrace my steps right back to where I was. And here it is. Stay nice and quiet. Go down these stairs. Actually, just a little bit across here, and then we're just going to jump over, which would be a lot faster, and we can survive this fall easily. There we go. And nobody's the wiser. Now we can go back down to the Pridwin command deck. And um, before you do that, use your stealth voice so that you're invisible when you get down there, because Elder Maxon and a guy in a power armor and another guy are going to be right there. And if they see you, they're going to plow into you and you're going to be dead in a New York minute, okay? So get yourself invisible, get your favorite weapon on, hook up your gas grenades, insert diabolical laughter again, and huck one of those babies out there. <laughs> I'll show you what happens to traitors. Nice try. Get them to attack each other. Lovely. Fantastic. Okay, so that brought them down to size. Down goes the Brotherhood Knight. Elder Maxon seems like really either freaked out or I don't know, almost dead or I don't know what. One thing I do want is the final judgment. Gatling laser. Special Gatling laser. Elder Maxons. And that's it, we're done. Let's get the F out of Dodge. And we're home free. There we go. Long live the Brotherhood. He's in. Right on. What's taking you? Until Slack comes to dinner. <laughs> and uh, I forgot to tell you this. A Nuka Cola Quantum will be extremely useful at this point. Because Tinker Tom's going to have a little bit of problems. And he's going to have some problems flying this Verdi Bird. And he's going to pull uh, one of those things. That, remember that Far Cry 4 was it? Far Cry 3 or Far Cry 4, where it ends where the guy flies around the airport like a couple times because he can't fly very well. It's the same deal here. You're getting shot to shit, and your minigun is pretty much useless. You're not going to gun anyone down. So as soon as your health gets really low, hit the, the Nuka Cola Quantum, and that will jack up your health very quickly. Okay, I'm just playing right down the line here because I'm only half half dead. <laughs> I could take a little more. We're out of the blast range now. Here goes nothing. Shit! Whoa. Now that's a hell of a thing. Rest okay, now watching back the video, I noticed that my help took a ding here somehow. I'm at I'm 
half dead now. Drink. Yeah, right there. See that? Yeah, so now it's time to take the Nuka Cola Quantum. Go ahead, gobble it up. Guzzle that back, slack. See, I hadn't even noticed yet. There we go, I finally noticed. I go, what the hell happened to my health? Yeah, there we go. Okay, so. End of the line. Let's fast travel back to Sanctuary. And call it a day. And that's it. I'd like to thank you all very much for watching. See you next video.